Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Perch Pro 2018. This is the last and final episode and the teams have only four hours left to fish. It's very tight between Vision Fly Dressing and Team Sporting for the number point. Team Sporting has caught 57 perch, but Vision Fly Dressing is only two fish away and it could go either way. The biggest perch so far today has been caught by Vision Fly Dressing with a weight of 1.24 kilos. It's a big perch and it could be hard to beat. At the moment, Vision Fly Dressing has one point, CWC Fishing Team one point, and Team Sporting four points. It's time to do battle and see who will be the Perch Pro of 2018. Welcome back for the final episode of Perch Pro. The game is still on. We're not beaten yet by the other teams. We're still aiming for the big fish. New spot, new chances, and watch us win. Let's rock and roll. CWC fishing team with Evert Ostam and Jimmy Lindahl are fishing a big lake down in the Netherlands and their plan is to catch a jumbo perch each day. They succeeded the first day when they caught a massive one of 2.255 kilos and you never know with them. On a small river up in northern Sweden, Daniel Bergman and Stefan Jensen are ready to do their best and catch as many perch as possible on fly rods. We just made the lunch report here in Team Vision Fly Dressing and now we are enjoying a cup of coffee. We got 55 fish. Uh, over 30 centimeters so far. Biggest one is 1.24, which we are, uh, it's good, uh, but it would feel really good if we can get some more. We got a lot of fish, but most of them are way too small, especially now at the moment. So our plan is the last hours just to keep on trying to get numbers. Uh, I don't feel comfortable yet with 55 fish. I want to, I want to get it even higher. But it's difficult at the moment because our stand is out there. We can't, we probably caught 100, 150 fish today, but they're just too small. So if that doesn't change, we're gonna be, we're gonna, gonna struggle. Okay, so let's do this. The fish keep coming for vision fly dressing, but as Stefan said, they're too small to count. <sighs> we're cursed. Baby, it's again too small. Team Sporting with Stefan Nielsen and Robin Stockhouse are also fishing up in the north of Sweden, but they're on a lake rather than a river. We had quite good fishing this morning. The first couple of hours was re extremely good and then it slowly died a little bit. So we ended up with 57 perch before our lunch break. Now it's the final hours, so it's time to step up. Our goal is to pass a hundred perch a little bit more. We'll see if we can find them. Right now we are fishing a little deeper part. We are around eight meter right now. And I have go drop shot and Robin go g cat, see if we can find the perch and get them in to the boat. So um, that's the plan. Let's go. This is a big one. This is a, re take the net. Take the net. Oh, take the net. It's a kilo one. Oh, it's not. Isn't it? No. Well, we take the net anyway. Not enough, but look at that one. You're really, really welcome in this boat. I can't, can't say how much I have missed you. Three cast, three fishes. This is a little bit smaller, but I think it's... Maybe. Stefan got one too. This, this one's good. nice. Is it nice? Uh, yeah. It's good enough. Yeah, that's definitely sure. good enough. Far away from Team Sporting are Ilex Gunky with Frederik Julian and Thomas Engert. They're fishing a big lake in the southern part of the Netherlands and searching for one massive perch. The fishing has been really tough for them. We're going to keep armoring this deep spot in the search of a really big one. Uh, we really believe that uh, 
I might be uh, a little bit deeper than uh, usual. So uh, we're gonna hammer uh, the second edge and uh, found a, a spot a little bit out in the blue. So we use a lot of the Navionics maps and uh, our knowledge of the spots to position the boat and fish around those uh, shoulders. So I'm using this metal lure. Often I use such metallic lures like the Deraku on my first cast on a new spot. Of course, it's a brilliant search bait and you easily see if there are fish around who are active. Not big, not big. Not big? No. In this year's competition, the perch need to be over 30 centimeters and this one is clearly not. Sorry, Frederick, it doesn't count. It's unbelievable today, only the small fish. Huh? Even on these spots, this spot delivers yesterday a, a nice fish and the days before as well. And today, only small fish around. Ah, this better is one? better. This is better. Okay. I come with the net. Never give up! Never Man. give up! This is a kilo fish. You see, small fish, small fish, small fish, and, the big and then fish. in between, in boom, boom, big boom! Fish. Never give up, really. And again, Caesar comes. That was the right move to, you know, we start to target the tiny bite. We start with a, a small size, and then after we said, okay, uh, they are there, we believe they are mixed with uh, bigger fish chasing in the middle. And then we change to the bigger size and that pays. That perch is definitely over one kilo, but is it enough to win the big fish point? Frederick puts it in the live well, so we'll have to see later. Yeah. Look at these beauties. Two costs on the twinky one with the 18 grams Yamakatsu head. That's enough. Yamakatsu hook right in the lip. Of course, the Danish perch from Aesok Skia, Curly Lucy. Now in short time we have caught 12 uh, approved uh, perches and uh, it seems like they like uh, the drop shot rig, mostly, the bigger ones. Because we're getting smaller ones too, around 25 to 29. Uh, but we will definitely keep hammering in this area, probably for the rest of the, rest of the day. Well, what's your opinion? Right now it's pretty hot. They, they You're like hot like right a sauna, now. tell. Tell this it. is the shallows we find them since we arrived on three days of fishing. This is the most shallow we, we ever find them. So I hope we can stay on them here. Uh, this is what we're using right now. And uh, one little friend uh, just puked up this one. A small, small roach. Uh, so that's what they're feeding. Uh, this color well, that we call Twinkie is almost uh, look like the same. This is a little bit big, but this is, was a big, bigger perch who, um, who, uh, who lost it. And uh, for that, we're using the Gamakatsu size one, and we use that one for uh, for the Curly Lucy. Works really good, and you almost hook every fish on it. Uh, almost every fish. Look here. Look at that Look one. Here. Almost every fish. Almost every fish. All of them we hook. So Daniel has hooked onto something big. We haven't seen it yet. Let's uh, let me know if you if you need help with the net. I think it is quite static. I don't know, but I think it might be a personal best. 
on hubcap. <laughs> well, at, le at least it's from a Volvo. <laughs> For real. <laughs> Well done, mate. <laughs> Give it a pose. It's over 30. <laughs> made by Sweden. <laughs> oh, look at that. You can't throw it back, though. You have, you have to keep it. What the hell does people think to catch with this? Let's hope the next one is a BMW. <laughs> <laughs> this could be a new competition. Gather your own car. <laughs> So I think I'm onto something here. CWC fishing team are searching and searching, but they can't find any fish that are willing to bite, and they've now changed spot again. Okay, we uh, went to a new place. We both didn't have that feeling, the feeling that the perch maybe could be there. So we did a couple of casts and then uh, moved away uh, right away. Because when you come to a spot, you always must have that feeling that it's gonna happen over there. And that's why we try a new spot. Just a couple of casts here in the entrance of the harbor to see if uh, something is going on. And uh, after that, we go back to our uh, number one spot and uh, finish it off over there. The number one now, but too short, but let's say uh, yeah, too short. We put it back in the spa to save it from the cormoran. So now, no more bite, so we're going to just move to the next hole and uh, see if we can uh, reproduce target them and then spot lock and again fish a little bit more slowly and get another one. Now uh, we are fishing uh, out from a deep hole into the shallow and over the three days of competition, I was always using my new artist rods. And what is for me incredible, the rods are 15% lighter in the blank. And the result is 35% more power. But it's really, really good. And especially when you fish like Perch Pro, 10 hours a day, weight and balance, believe me, that counts. Bloom, bloom. Whoa, a nice attack. I have a, a little bit too much slack line, you know? Yeah, uh, that was the same, a little bit the same for me. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, it's one o'clock. Fishing has gone totally dead. <laughs> Deja vu from yesterday. And we got one fish the last hour, so but we still got one more than yesterday. Oh yeah. <laughs> we need to. We're gonna try some different tactics. Uh, see if if there is fish here, and if we can catch them uh, by by fishing different. Uh, my hopes aren't that high, but it's worth a try. And the next problem is that we are in this little river. And so by some reason today we got invaded by people fishing from the bank. And that leaves us in a position where we can more or less move. We can't move around the way we want. Well, and search not, for fish. not without disturbing them and annoying them. And then there has to be room for everybody. Ah! <laughs> Madman. Um, let's do it. I'm going to change to a floating line and a heavy sinking fly. See if that works. The same as the last day, from out of nowhere, Team Sporting hooks a better fish among all the smaller ones. The energy levels are on top now. Oh! Oh! Yes! Oh, 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 oh. Look at this. Isn't this a beauty? Oh, you see? Come on, 
play this one. Yeah, of course. This could be a new top fish for the day. Let's see if it's bigger than Vision Fly dressings of 1.24 kilos. 12, 1,210 grand. No, yeah, 1,210. Awesome! <laughs> Life is very good! <laughs> Bye! It was very close, but not big enough to steal the big fish point from Vision Fly dressing. Only 30 grams away, but it's still a very big and beautiful perch. Well done, Stefan. Well, our perch catching ha hasn't been that good uh, this afternoon, but, but we caught some other fun stuff. Uh, these are some of the local fishing tackle. Uh, we caught this rig. I think it's a new kind. Uh, we got two hooks and a heavy jig at the bottom on a braided line. Uh, we got a special sinker. This is the eco version of a sinker. 2018 yeah. stone sinker. Yes. Which brings us to our, our next item. Uh, this one. I don't really know what they are hoping to catch with this one. I don't, I actually think it's even too big to foul hook perch with. And then we have this, uh, the Volvo hubcap. Uh, personal best for myself, I'm quite pleased with this one. Uh, and we also have a cased caddis on this hubcap, uh, which is probably what some of the fish eat. Uh, good trout food. Usually it's uh, no release, no glory, but uh, these items we thought we should take out of the river. Maybe we'll do a muse museum or something. Or oh, we can use them ourselves. Yeah, but we need three more of the hubcaps. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the mind game is definitely on at the moment, and uh, the frustration level is maxed. So a bit more of a bit more of funny things to happen, then we uh, we could be quite close to a mental breakdown. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't hit any logs, man. No, there aren't any logs here. But if I catch one more stone or a mussel, or... Uh, I'm not totally sure we are still in the leading, but uh, uh, I don't really care right now. It's it's uh, it's out of our control. <laughs> but I'm really happy about that hubcap. Definitely, that's my probably my, be my best catch ever. And again, looking at the result. Mm. We had today, it's, it's good. Yeah. I mean, it's quiet now, but it's good. It's been good fishing, and you caught a beautiful big fish. Um, so, overall, if it, had, it wouldn't have been competition, I would have thought this would have been a fantastic day already. Yeah. Good one? No. Not the good one, but at least a perch. Okay, filling in the two o'clock reports. We caught some, but it was small, so we're still on uh, five fish. And still, eight to 90 is the biggest one. Now we go uh, back to our uh, number one spot so to say and for the last two hours we will hammer that spot until it's time uh, <clears throat> that's the only thing what we can do because uh, we tried a lot of spots and almost nothing no bites i don't know why but they're off and at our number one spot we know that they are that the uh, we lost a couple of big ones to, uh, this morning, so it's uh, all or nothing now. Short two hours, and we're gonna hammer them, and hopefully the big one uh, will come off. So. Uh CWC fishing team is heading back to the spot they believe most in, and up north in Sweden, it's one fish after another for team sporting. It's hammer oh, time, baby! Wait, 
This is a big one. This is a big one. Oh. <laughs> Come here. Yes. We are we are hammering right now. Yeah. I'm definitely in the zone. I haven't had to get my jig out before I have. That's a new one. How many ones are nice ones all the time now? There's a really big, nice big fish. Have you had one? Yeah, this, one, this one's a nice one too. The fish are super nice. Can you guess what jig it is? Uh, I say the Danish perch. This is insane fishing right now. Danish perch is outstanding. We're running out of jigs, we got only seven or eight left for the last hour. I had more than 22 perch for the last hour now, and they're all super size, decent size. My biggest is 1210. These are at least an average size now, super nice. Boom! Today I don't know how many how many spots we have tried. Many. But really many. And but we have been there for about five or ten minutes and go some kilometers, try no spot. And it uh, pays off, finally. <sighs> nice one again. Boom! Go yeah. get mama. Oh, what a strike. Feels good too. Nice one. Yeah, is it? Yeah, definitely a nice one. <laughs> <laughs> what about this fishing? Huh? Three hours with the shittiest fishing in history and now? We smash them. Yeah, that's. Oof. This is a good one. This yes. is a good one. Oh, this, Ooh, is, a this nice is a really good one. Get it come out on, here. Come on. A good one too. Don't Take get the tank. Oh, no. oh, this is really. Get the net. What the fuck? Chaos. I take mine first. Kilo fish. Uh, yeah, what about mine? Yeah. Uh, what about mine? You oh, put the rod out in front of me. Get the, get the rod out of here. You, fuck. So. What the <laughs> fuck is going on? Ah! <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Easily a kilo fish again. This is not good. Look what happened here. What about this? Crazy fishing. I'm on it. Keeper. Yes. We come back to uh, the spot we, where uh, Fred caught his kilo fish. And first cast, drop shot rigged with a scissor comp. I get immediately a bite and it's a nice fish again. Oh, and very healthy. Okay, put you, put you in the spa. Put you in the spa. Fish on, fish on. Achtung. Not, not big, not big. Egal. It's okay. Fish is a fish. The main thing is we have some more action now. We need one more fish to top the rest of the rest of the day. At least to have the same. I'm gonna again. Oh, maybe small, huh? I'm gonna drift a little bit. Maybe you are a little bit too much on top. Hey, can you please stop that? We're trying to film here. Oh, he went over the plastic bag. He's a badass. It's just fantastic to be out in the wild. It's so quiet. <laughs> <laughs> um. When you're in an area where you know the fish are, they are at that place. Many times you, you have a tendency to, to just accept the fact that the fish are not biting and say, okay, hey, we're gonna, we're gonna switch spot instead. In many cases, it's just as important to try and use new techniques, different weight on the fly, different line, just simply new techniques, more speed, lower speed, uh, and before we've done that, you can actually not say that the fish are not biting. Now we change tactic, tactics. I'm actually back to the old, uh, the old school thing which we've been running. 
and Daniel is beating the numbers out of me. So I'm probably yeah. going to change this as well. Oh, fish on. Oh, it's first fish for me in a long, 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 long time. Awesome, buddy. That's a nice fish. Good sized fish. Let's fly out my grass away. You know which fish that is? Nope. That's fish number 60. Is that fish number 60? Yes. Great, let's put him back. Oh, oh we're back in business, maybe. <laughs> yes, yeah. sir. Uh, this one, I'm not sure about this one, but we'll put him on the board. Yes, sir. Oh. One hour left, Daniel. Let's yep. rip some lips and gain numbers. CWC fishing team is fishing their number one spot, but they haven't felt anything. Evert, should you really be eating food when there's not much time left? No, coffee. It only takes two minutes, but it gave, gave energy. And of course, for my friend Jimmy. Jimmy. Thanks a lot, my friend. We drive back for a new drift. And in the meantime, we drink our coffee. This last drift, it must do. And we did it day one. Yeah. With all. We can manage to do it the last day also. The fishing has slowed down for Ilex Gunky again, so they decide to weigh the biggest fish they caught earlier. Could it be a top fish? Okay, let's wait. Let's weigh this fish. Yep. Nice one. Now it's one zero eight five. Yeah, man. Good one job. Kilo fish. Good job. Just over the kilo. Perfect. Fish on. Oh, I think it's a thunder, but I'm not sure. I'm with you. Oh, I think it's a thunder. It's not really shaking. Oh, scheiße, Dreck. Big, big bird. Wow, white one. Oh, Look at that. Oh. <laughs> now, is it something kind of an albino? Huh? <laughs> is it a kind of an albino bird? Tell me. <laughs> oh, look at that. Never caught a bird in this color in my life. Never. And this is a very good fish. Oh yes, it's slightly over a kilo. So, uh, it's well over the kilo. <laughs> Thank you, Boogie Crow. Yeah, 47. <laughs> Man, that's what we needed. After the orange bird, the white bird. Oh, we are in the middle no, of the no, ship. No, 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 we are perfect. Oh, and what a bite. Boom, boom. That's a jumbo perch with an incredible white color. A real dream fish. Crazy that you caught it when there was only half an hour left in the competition. Time to weigh it and see if it's a new top fish. It's on zero. Oh, he bite me. Let's wait for the old. Hold. 
1655. Yes! Yes! It's incredible. A white a white and fish. our best fish. It, our, yeah, it's our, our uh, best fish and a white one. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that beauty. Oh. It's a new top fish for Ilex Gunky and the second biggest fish ever caught in Perch Pro history. Very good fish and very well deserved. Ah, Fred! <laughs> good jump! Yeah, lucky punch! Let's hope it will win a point today. We, we, we deserve it for, yeah, such, for really. such a hard job. Yeah. And I'm going to ask new rules for next, uh, next year. Every uh, new color on the perch is do double the size. <laughs> kind of a bonus. We, we have the bonus point for the color. I really thought it is a thunder when it comes up and it was so, so white. So I first I think, shit, a thunder again. But it was a perch. <laughs> Unbelievable. Wow. This is why I'm going fishing and not playing golf. <laughs> so amazing. I used the, the boogie craw, the three and a half inch. This is the bigger one. We have two si I have two sizes in my box. And I move it this time not so much. Just 20 centimeters up, down, up, down. Give him an ar arrest and on the bottom, he take it directly from the bottom, not in the move. Often the big perch make like this. They take the chance when the, when the bait is on the bottom and don't move. So sometimes you should not fish too fast. Team Sporting has the number points catching 96 perch so far. Stefan, do you think 100 fish will be enough? Mm, no. I don't think so. Sorry. At least 120. That would be say. Uh, that's what we said this morning. 120, and I ain't gonna change now. No, I don't think 100 will be enough. But actually, this is a dream fishing. This is insane. This is totally insane. Bam! Ooh! This is a big one. Oh, uh, isn't it? It's a kilo fish uh, kilo again. Fish again. Lift it in fast. Ah. Is this green fishing or what? Time is fast running out, and now would be a very good time for CWC fishing team to catch another two kilo perch. <clears throat> this can maybe a good drift as well, yeah. because this is shallow, deep, and shallow. Yeah. We're in the oh. Yeah, 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 fish. S small, they are small, small, very small. Really small. I just wanted to say this can be maybe a good spot because this is a way through. Well, Jimmy did it three minutes before time or four. Yeah. I will do it the last minute. Just keep the excitement going for Perch Pro. Yeah, fish. Yeah. You think it's, it's perch. perch? Eight meters. No, it's not a huge one, but it's perch on eight meters. No, it's small one. Yeah, but eight meters of water. Nice. But in the gully, uh, Jimmy. In this gully, yeah. while other spots fail, now we have action on the blades. Starting to, to be time for the great strike now. Stefan, what are your thoughts about the fishing? Which team is going to win? I think uh, it, when it comes to the end, there'll be, it could be two or three different teams ending up with two points. Nobody gonna have three points. I don't think, I don't, don't believe in that. Think 
Somebody have, some have, but the guys have two points. And the one with the biggest fish got to win it all. And I'm trying the best I can to get over 125 so we can get point for today. And this one is a nice one again. It just keep coming. Pretty, pretty, pretty fish. Super nice condition. And of course, again, Danska Boris, as we say in Swedish. This Dan the Danish purse, like we say in English. You see this one? I prefer the Swedish polka gris for that the one. The Swedish polka gris <laughs> works too. This is a color we, we trimmed a little bit down to go faster when we fish deeper. Normally, it's a little wider body. In the bigger picture, I say, I'm sorry, but I don't think we have any chance. Both CVC and Ilex, Ilex Gank are in southern uh, Holland, and we know that the fishing, how it could be there. But if they, in some reason, have, have really slow fishing, everything can happen. Last day, bef after, before the report, what was the bis biggest? Just over one kilo. That was fly dressing. Yeah. But uh, you don't know, maybe they could have a storm or the ice, have co ice has coming to, to, to early. Uh, <laughs> but that can happen to us also. A fucking beer can eat us up here. Or a moose can kick, kick the motor <laughs> off the boat or something. I don't know. <laughs> Fuck, I'm tired. <laughs> True, you never know what might have happened. And you're actually right. It was a storm down in the Netherlands which made it very hard for them to fish properly. If we take a look at Vision fly dressing instead, they started to catch them after a slow period, and one is a better fish. Hey, nice fish. Keep calm, be happy. Oh, wow. nice one. Beautiful. <laughs> I'll release you. Get that fly up. Beautiful fish. Put him back. Bye bye. It was quite a big fish. I don't know if it was around a kilo, maybe, maybe a little bit smaller. But there's no point in weighing it. We're going for numbers at the moment, and I know that Daniel's fish were bigger than this one. So, so I'm just gonna keep on fishing. Oh! I definitely recommend perch fly fishing, but maybe not. Oh! Hoo -hoo. This is a big one. <laughs> Log off. <laughs> no. Log out. Not this year. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go there. You're not going there. I'm mentally a lot stronger. <laughs> you had a lot of mental practice <laughs> training. Peace of mind, peace of mind. Be like the lotus. Accept. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Wax on. <laughs> Wax off. <laughs> oh. Perch Pro is a tough competition and fishing for 30 hours over three days really drains your energy. Although if you're catching fish, you'll soon find it's on top again. Fish on? Good fish? No. Tiny. A fish is a fish, even though it doesn't count. Too bad for Ilex Gunky. The fish are starting to get really active for them when there's only a few more minutes left to fish. I'm not sure anymore. Yeah, when he's coming alone, and then... Uh, keeper. Yeah, nice. Yeah, thank you. <clears throat> it seems like the activity is bringing more and more fish. So, never give up. We combine a little bit of drop shotting and jigging. And like this, we catch them one by one. Another take. Huh? I had a bite. When the, when the boat are passing, it's always good. Yeah, yeah. The, um, the boat are quite deep. It's a really huge boat. And uh, with very powerful engine. And so you cannot imagine how, how deep the current uh, 
is they create a lot of current, a lot of oxygen, and everything is moving under them. Uh, small, uh, small insects, small uh, bait fish, and uh, the big predators always take the opportunity to, to eat right behind it. The traffic now is just insane. Look at this, it's a real highway for boat. <laughs> Isn't this pretty? It's just insane. Norland is the ship. I, I understand why people go to Holland with one, but here in Sweden, in the north of Sweden, there's nobody. We have been alone on the whole lake for five days. We see nobody, nobody here, only us. I bet they see a thousand boats down in Holland. Once again, Danish perch color. It's close to the end. Uh, five minutes left now. And we are trying to get the last, if we can. We have 119 and uh, we want to get 120. We wanted to get 125, but we, we have to sell for 120. So, and then we'll see if it is enough to take us all the way to a point. Um, it's tricky. It could be. Uh, it, but uh, anyway, we did a great day. We caught a ton of really, really, really nice fish. I'm really happy, pleased with this trip to the north of Sweden. It's been awesome. We got a ton of new friends. We had some great fishing. So uh, for us, it's been a great trip. It's been a really good Perth Pro 2018 for us, that's for sure. The clock is ticking and now there's only one minute left to fish. One minute. Fish on. Good one. Oh. I'm right there. It's perch. It's bigger than the other one. Ah, again! Oh, another fish over one kilo, exactly on the last cast. Competition is over. Perch Pro. That's correct. Time is up and all the teams must stop fishing. That's it, buddy. Mm. Game over. Yep. To be continued. We are more than happy. We're totally exhausted. It's going to be really great to get back to the cabin and get a, some good food or something to sleep tonight. We didn't make it, my friend. No. Come on, my friend. We do this even if we're not just the big one today. Thank you. We did a hell of a job. Yeah, we did. I will say to the viewers, I hope you enjoyed us because our uh, 0.89 fish won't be the winning fish. I'm sure about that. We did our best and I will congratulate uh, the winner of uh, Perch Pro 2018. Hopefully, see you next year. Thanks for watching. Thanks. Bye-bye. Uh, we ended up with 63 fish today. That's pretty good. That's very good. Uh, during the circumstances, top fish 124. I'm pretty happy with that. Beautiful, beautiful fish. Yeah. I don't think we're gonna make it, maybe. No, we uh, don't. We don't stand a chance. But I'm happy anyway. Uh, we we fought damn hard. Uh, we did everything we could. Yeah. Well, we caught nice fish every day and good numbers. Yeah. So we we gotta be happy with our effort. Definitely. I'm happy. Let's close it up and head back home. Wow. Give me a hug, baby. <laughs> well done. While both CWC fishing team and Vision Fly Dressing are signing out, Ilex Gunky has one more fish to measure and release. Yeah, 45. 45. 45. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Good job. Put it back. I'm From finished. zero to hero. Oh. <laughs> so, so <laughs> man, we make it. Yeah, under that circumstances. We start strong. Strong. And maybe we finish strong. Yes. So.
Yes. I don't know. That's that's right. One point six and something could could save us a point on the last day. Maybe. It's a solid fish. It's a solid fish, yeah. And a funny color. Absolutely. So Let's go home. Yes. I'm hungry. <laughs> Time to look at the final scoreboard for the competition. Team Sporting outperformed all the other teams and caught a whopping 120 perch on the final day. That gives them one point for the numbers. Good work. For the whole day, Vision Fly Dressing had the biggest fish, but with just 30 minutes to go, Ilex Gunky caught an enormous white perch of 1.655 kilos. That fish goes down in Perch Pro history, and they claim the big fish point for the final day. Vision Fly Dressing end up with zero points, even though they were really close to scoring a point every day of the competition. Ilex Gunky have one point, but in truth they weren't far away from winning. Well fought. CWC Fishing Team ends up with one point after catching the biggest perch in Perch Pro history with a weight of 2.255 kilos. So the winner this year is Team Sporting with Stefan Nielsen and Robin Stockhouse with a total of four points. They decided to do something completely different this year and stuck to their plan. During the fishing, they also managed to catch the longest perch with a length of 50 centimeters. Congratulations on the victory, guys. You really deserve it. Ladies and gentlemen, you've been watching Perch Pro 2018 and make sure you don't miss the next season of Fly vs Jerk 9 that will roll out in a week's time. My name is Philip O'Connor and this season was produced by Pontus Kralund and edited by Tobias Eichwald. Tight lines everyone and congratulations again to Stefan Nielsen and Robin Stockhouse from Team Sporting. We want to thank all the great people we met in Norland, especially Eva and Pia. They're amazing. People are uh, totally great without them, they haven't been with for, to help us with everything we need up here. And thanks to all our sponsors and thank everybody for a great Perth Row 2018. See you next we, year. Be back next year.